now let me create the remaining functions in order to search for an item in the dictionary let me create a function similarly to delete an item from the dictionary let me create a function first search so def followed by some suitable name for the function dictionary should be passed the element that you want to search that should also be passed now you can write a document string used to search for an item in the dictionary okay now we want to check whether this item this key to be precise is present in this dictionary or not okay so how can you do that if e in d meaning the item is present for the time being let me write pass later i will remove this pass okay pass means empty statement else you can say print e is not present in the dictionary you can write e is not present in the dictionary so e is written outside double quotes so that the value of the variable e appears here okay so e is not present in the dictionary now suppose if this condition is correct if e in d meaning e is present in the dictionary okay so you can write print e is present in the dictionary okay and you can write the corresponding values okay uh, number of games won by team e so you can write print print you can write number of games won equals so how do you get the number of games won see uh, this key contains name of the team as the key and values is this list okay and this list contains the first item of the list is number of games won second item of the list is number of games lost and the third item of the list is number of games drawn okay so this is your e so how do you get this value it is d of e will give you this value okay let me store that in variable v so v contains this list now how do you get number of games won it is the first item of the list how do you get first item of the list v of 0 will give you the first item of the list similarly how do you get number of games lost it's the second item of the list your v is pointing to this list okay so v of 1 will give you the number of games lost and v of 2 will give you the number of games drawn okay so here let me write number of games 1 equals first let me store the value okay so v equals v equals d of key so e is the name of the team that is the key so d of key will give you the value and here value is nothing but this one this list so now your v is pointing to this list i want to get number of games one so v of zero will give you number of games one v of one will give you number of games lost v of two will give you number of games drawn so here you can write number of games one equals v of zero now you can copy paste this one number of games lost lost equals v of one again you can write number of games drawn okay number of games drawn equals v of two so this is a function that will check whether this key is present in this dictionary or not 
the statement is very simple if e in d meaning e is present otherwise e is not present if e is present the details of e displayed in the computer's monitor now let me create another function to delete an item from the dictionary okay so i think i can copy paste this one because search is involved in deletion oh maybe is not present in the dictionary maybe for readability you can break here that is better otherwise readability is lost okay okay now let me create another function so let me replace this one with a delete so i want to delete this key from this dictionary used to delete an item from the dictionary okay now if e in d meaning e is present you can delete otherwise e is not present in the dictionary now print e is present in the dictionary uh, the details of the item that you want to delete that must be displayed in the computer's monitor only after that it must be deleted and in order to delete you can write d e l followed by d of key okay so this is the way you delete a delete an item from the dictionary it is d e l followed by d of key so uh, this key will be deleted from this dictionary so two more functions are ready and the remaining functions will be displayed in the may be written in the next video tutorial